Hey guys, this is Kamiguno, and today I'm doing a review for Bidden Season 2, Episode 5. So let's talk about this episode. So Elena and Savannah are still kidnapped by Alistair, uh, and throughout this episode, Elena's trying to figure out a way uh, to at least gain Savannah's trust. I won't say to escape, because it's pretty much impossible to do so at this point, but she is trying to gain the trust of Savannah. And then, of course, the, the pack and... And Jeremy and, and the other witches are trying to figure out a way to save Savannah and, and Elena, which is still not really working out. And we learn a little bit more about the prophecies, how Alistair is even possible, how... Not how female wolves are possible, but it's definitely explored about female wolves, because we get to see that crazy nut scientist become a werewolf, uh, but not survive, because obviously Elena is really the only werewolf to survive the process and become a true werewolf. Uh, and also we get to see a little story with Rachel. Uh, she gets injected by Savannah's blood. Don't know what that means for Rachel, but she's just trying to escape and it's not working out for her. Uh, and that's what's going on throughout the, the whole episode. Last episode was one of my favorites of the series, and honestly, this episode continues just a great run from what we got from last episode. A lot of character development, and here we also get to see character development, but also interesting plot uh, development here also, um, because we get to learn a little bit about this, this mythology, this world of werewolves and witches and how that's even possible. And there are a couple of twists and turns, finding out who Alistair's um, real mother is, uh, and seeing who do you trust, who do you not trust. Does it matter if you're a werewolf or a witch? Do you have to go against each other? Uh, and then Alistair just being this puppet master um, with everybody, controlling the situation making the scientist a werewolf, picking the right crazy person to become a werewolf. So Alistair is honestly a great villain, and that's something I was complaining about in the beginning of the season, because I was like, ah, oh, Malcolm, how do I feel about you? And then he dies, and we get an awesome villain like Alistair, and learning more about the witches, and connecting it with the werewolf mythology, because werewolves are created with witches. So I think this world has been built so well in this season so far, and really I would say in these past two episodes. Um, I'm very much interested in seeing how Rachel, Savannah, and Elena escape this situation, and will Savannah go towards the dark side? It seems like she's very much on this leeway side that she could trust Elena, but at the same time she might end up trusting Alistair and backstabbing Elena. So I think that's going to be a very interesting thing, hopefully that will be explored next episode. And I want to learn a little bit more about Rachel. If I had a, a little complaint, but also I guess a positivity to uh, this episode, is uh, uh, Rachel has so much potential. She's, I don't even know if she's still pregnant at this point because she's been tortured so much, but uh, she has a possibility of becoming a witch, maybe with this whole blood thing. Don't know if that's how it works in this world. Uh, and I, and she's still, you know, staying true to Logan. She's been tortured, but she's still staying true to the person she loves and uh, dealing with this new world. I mean, she really just found out about werewolves, what, a couple of months ago, maybe one or two months ago. Uh, and now she's dealing with all this torture. I love the way she's dealing with it. And I, I hope they utilize the character even more as the season continues. Continues. But just another great addition here. Again, learning more um, of the world and also, of course, progressing the plot and having awesome character development. Just another great episode in a great direction of season two of Bidden. So very excited to see what happens next episode. And of course, I'll have a review next Friday for that. Hope you guys enjoyed. This is Comic Uno. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also in the description below, there's links from my comic book, Like Father Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father Like Daughter. I'll see you guys later. Bye.